How do we use a personal geodatabase, a .mdb file like this one, in ArcGIS Pro? Well, if we go to the catalog window in Pro and go on that folder, we can see that there's nothing visible. And that's because Pro doesn't support personal geodatabases. So we're going to need to convert it to something we can use, like a file geodatabase. But Pro doesn't seem to have any tools to convert it, which is a bit odd because it is an Esri format. But one way we could do that conversion is in QGIS. Now, QGIS is completely free to use, so anybody can download and install it and link in the description. Uh, and I have both ArcGIS Pro and QGIS on my machine. So it's a very good piece of software. If we go in the browser window in QGIS, which is a bit like the catalog window, and we go in that same folder, we can see that we can see that personal geodatabase. These are supported in QGIS. And if we go into that database, we can see the feature classes. Now we need to do these one at a time. So we'd go on the first feature class, right click, go to export layer and to file. And we get this save as dialogue. And there's a number of formats we can save out to. And one of those is Esri File Geodatabase. So we're going to use that one. We then need to navigate to the folder, uh, give it a name. Save that and then give the layer a name. Just going to go with what it's already put up there. And then we just OK that. Do the same for all of the other feature classes within the database. And again, what we can do is we can just select the one we've already created last time and select this GDB file, whatever that is. And OK, so it's going to the same geodatabase as the other one. Give it a name and OK. So now if we return to ArcGIS Pro, and let's just refresh that. Now we can see the file geodatabase that was created. And if we go in there, we can see both of our feature classes, which have been converted from that personal geodatabase. And that is how you can convert a personal geodatabase into something we can use in Pro.